guys welcome back to the vlog it is Thursday afternoon it's wedding weekend Amy's sister's getting married this weekend we just left work and we are going our separate ways yeah gotta do wedding preparation festivities yeah Amy's going golfing that's aka he's going golfing I gotta get these nails fixed with with the wedding party yeah they are still from Coachella and stuff so I'm gonna get like a nice nude color while Andy goes golfing we're both gonna have a little fun afternoon and then tonight we have dinner at this Mexican restaurant um, with a lot of people, basically like David's whole family and family and ours. friends yeah. dinner pre-wedding. So that's the plan for and today. And the Suns play today. And the Suns play, you guys. Do you think Devin Booker's gonna play? No. <laughs> double or nothing. I paid Andy ten dollars. No, oh yeah, double or nothing. Double or nothing. She never paid me. Okay, double or nothing. So that's twenty dollars. I don't think he's gonna play either, but it's fun. So yeah, Suns play. It's an exciting. Time. Okay, how about we'll bet 10 again, but I'll bet you that he does play this time and you bet that he doesn't. No, because Cause then, if then he, he's going to play and I'm going to be mad. He's not going to play. So okay, then we'll so then we'll be zero? Yeah. No, but I want to stick to my bet. No, nope, now I got it. So now if he plays, then I it flip Then you get $20. But yeah, we got to go. And he's got to go to golf. My appointment's in like 10 minutes. So we just wanted to say hi quick. And my family comes tomorrow. My parents, my brother was supposed to come. I'm not sure if he is, he doesn't feel too good, so he may not come. But my parents get here tomorrow at, I think 4 p.m. Tomorrow we have like a rehearsal, it's a long day. We have a rehearsal, we have a dinner party. It's not a rehearsal dinner, is it? Today? No, tomorrow. No, tomorrow's a rehearsal dinner, yeah. Yes. Just finished with my nails. I got this like really light, color it's actually called 112 <laughs> which is funny 112 obviously I had to get the 112 but I forgot my rings today and you can tell because there's literally tan lines on my fingers but I love how they turned out nice little like almond usually I get them a little bit longer I would have liked them a little bit longer but they're good for now and they won't break so love them perfect for the wedding and I got the same color on my toes and like a gel so Nails are done, took like almost two hours. So that's fun. But now I'm gonna go home, probably sit by the pool for a minute. Oh, it's just blurry. My camera's been like not focusing lately. I don't know why. It's like weird with the autofocus. Anyways, I just ordered a wrap from Chop Shop and a green juice. I'm gonna go pick that up. I was gonna go to Sephora and get self tan drops from like Isle of Paradise or something because I've used them before and I like them um, and my other tanning stuff got taken when I was on vacation last so I don't have any but the UV is 9 so I'm just going to go home put banana boat on my skin and sit in the sun <laughs> I'm a freak and I love to tan so that's the plan for the rest of the day until we go to dinner let's go get my juice I just got out of the shower and I wanted to show you guys this little ice roller. I don't know why I call everything little, but I just do. From the Skinny Confidential. I got it in the mail when I got back from my trip. And it's something that I never knew I needed. It's actually really nice and I didn't realize how nice it, it would be until getting it. So. If you guys don't have a nice roller, I highly suggest getting it because it's nice to like wake you up in the morning and just it's fun. It, it feels good and it's fun. And this one does stay cold like really long. Like I had this in the freezer for the past like two days and then I took it out. It's been out for like an hour and it's still like ice cold. So that's a plus. We are getting ready for our dinner. It's at 7 p.m. at this place called the Mexicano. We went there once, actually we filmed some vlog clips too. And it was a place that had like the massive frozen margaritas like in the pinata, or you get a pinata with it, that no one drank. 
So we're going back there. The Suns game just started. I have no idea what the score is. Hopefully they're winning. Hopefully. But I'm gonna get ready, dry my hair. I would show you guys a skincare routine, but like I don't really have one. I've shown you my moisturizer. I literally just use Dove soap to wash my face. And then this Summer Fridays moisturizer, which I've showed before. And occasionally I'll put a few drops of this Summer Fridays all-in-one face oil into the moisturizer. But I did that this morning, so I don't need to do it. Andy's wearing a nice polo. I'm gonna wear shorts. Yeah, I would wear shorts, it's hot. And I don't want to stop doing this because it feels so good. I got this new face like tool recently. I've been seeing it everywhere since I got it. And it's supposed to be like a gua sha kind of, but it has like micro electro current or something, electrodes, micro electrodes, something like that. And it's kind of like a stim for your face. So you do this in like motions and it kind of like tightens you. So I've been doing that recently. I'm gonna do this right now before. I dry my hair and I'm gonna film it to see if you can like tell the difference but this is the gel primer that it comes with this like activates the new face because it kind of stings if you don't have enough primer so, like you literally have to like layer it on your face and you you basically just rub this in after you're done I'm gonna have to take my towel off but let's see if you can tell a difference from now and after. You have to wait for the beep and go like very slowly and then beep two, two, three times. because this thing was expensive but if you're consistent with it i do think it has good results i'm already wearing this meow set meow corset meow pants off of revolve princess poly heels we're gonna go meet everyone at the hotel before dinner let's go get some mexican it's a dress and that's just a veil on that side <sighs> sneak peek of the dress you guys we just made it to Haley's suite look how beautiful this hotel is called the Omni. This is where they're getting married. Soon to be Mrs. Haley. Amy's trying to find the basketball game. <gasps> wow, those flowers are beautiful. Happy that we're home. <gasps> Hi, honey. It's time for bed. Go night night. Grandma and Grandpa come tomorrow. Good. <laughs> no, it was a one time thing. That's funny. It's blurry. That was funny. <laughs> it was blurry. That's so annoying. Stupid camera. Good morning, you guys. I'm so tired. Good morning. It is Friday morning at 7.30. We're up early. We got home last night at like 11.30 and then got right in bed. So we were up early, have a few things to do before our rehearsal at 10 a.m. And if you hear beeping, there's construction like right by our house. So it wakes us up every morning. Great. I'm gonna make some coffee. We're gonna get some breakfast and then we're gonna go to work. We just got sandwiches, you guys. We're done with the rehearsal. I'm with these Yay. fun ladies. Woo. If you watch the Tulum vlog, you know who they are. Woohoo! We're going are we shopping. Now? Oh, dancing yeah. on the table, all of us. The clips famous? of Aaron in that video are hilarious. So fucking funny. The shoe phone. Look Should at this back the massive sandwich. Mm. Oh yeah. Should we give the convenience store? Yeah. A I know. Shout out. There's this place. This is so good. In like North Scottsdale, and it's called the Convenient Corner, and they have the best freaking sandwiches. And Aaron got what'd you get? I you got a beer. Oh, 
a breakfast bacon bagel cheese. sandwich. So fire. Obviously. With avocado. Ooh, that good. Is there a napkin? I just need to, yeah, did we get, we did not get napkins, did we? Uh, we need oh, we've got some napkins. We've got napkins. Messy, messy. Turkey sandwich. Go to. It's okay if you spill. I'll vacuum the car later. Beef strami. Yum. So bomb. Put chipotle mayo on it. Mm. Yum. Mm. Oh, it's warm too. Oh my god, so good. This is better than Einstein bagel bros. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you sure? Oh my gosh, maybe it was a little handkerchief. Oh, that'd be cute. Yeah. That is cute. Handkerchief? Oh, that one's cute. Yeah, I feel like the one that. I'm on the way to pick up my parents from the airport. I'm running a little bit late because I was cleaning, like running around the house like crazy, trying to get everything done. I feel like the past day and a half has been really insane, which is like all the wedding stuff, all the people coming in, all the parties, all the events, all the stuff. So. They're waiting for me, they have their bags. I'm so excited to see them. I went to Boot Barn earlier. I think I showed you guys a little bit. I'm not really sure what I filmed in there because it was kind of crazy. But I picked up Andy a whole outfit, a whole country outfit. He got boots, I got a hat, I got pants, I got this funny country shirt. So I am gonna put that on him and see if it looks good. Hopefully it will, I think it will. But other than that, We'll do a boot barn haul with Andy when he gets home. He's golfing. They, the boys, like all of the bachelor, like had a huge golf tournament today. So Andy isn't home, which is why I've been like running around like crazy trying to clean everything, get everything ready for my parents. So that's what's going on. We're gonna pick them up. And then we have our country chic party tonight for the rehearsal dinner. Off. Off. Yes, I wanna be hot. Oh my, it's 90 degrees. Oh my God, turn it off. Nice sunglasses. Off. I left snow. I like those. They're you the ones I got from you. I know. <laughs> You're crazy. Oh, Moosey, well, that's hers. <laughs> Hi, honey. Okay, let's see Andy's reaction from the boot barn. My hat. No, yeah. Oh, I don't know if that's gonna fit you. I'm really nervous because I there's like a million different sizes. I don't know if it's gonna fit. This one's yours? That's mine. See, that's too small. Oh, oh, and dad said the smaller. Dang it! That's going back. Uh, so it's seven and a half though. Does that one fit? No, that's seven and a half. No, you said six. This is seven and eight. Oh, so you need seven. seven no! And a half. Oh. See, because this is like, it's oh tight, my it could God. almost fit. So I think I'm seven and a half. Dang it. Well, you can I, knew it was, I thought it was six and a half, but it's seven and a half. Yeah, that sucks. Seven and five eighths, just a little too big. Oh well. Dang. I could stuff some paper in the back. You could. Then it would just sit like this. There you go. Zach got some size medium, so I think it's extra what? large. Hopefully it doesn't look like this. No. Okay. Yeah, it's nice. It matches the belt. The black and brown. Yeah. And then, I think Shane has these. There's your pants. Nice. Black pants. Wrangler. Yeah, they're cute actually. You should wear those. Now for the grand reveal. Perfect size. Good job. Those are beautiful. Hopefully these fit. They're 13s? Yeah. Yeah, they'll fit. Man, now that the hat is too big. Oh god. Oh god. Use these to pull up. Oh yeah, it's perfect. You fit? Yeah. Oh my god, you look so funny. Well, my like shorts. Yeah, it's perfect. Shoulders are right there. Nice. Good work. Good job. Thank you. Oh, you're gonna have to do it again. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's so good. These are the best part. We've arrived, you guys. We're dressing Western chic, country chic. Out, or outfit sponsored by Boot Barn. Look at Andy. So cute. Andy, I think you belong in Montana. <laughs>
surprise. It's 7.30, I am just leaving the house to go to the Omni where the where the um, wedding is at. So we, all the bridesmaids have to be at the hotel at 7.45 to start getting ready, so. So we're all getting hair and makeup and we're there early. We're there for a long time. It's gonna be a really long day, but I'm so excited. Andy is still asleep. He doesn't have to be at his like groomsmen duties until I think 10.30 today. They have like haircuts and stuff, so. He's still sleeping. He's lucky he didn't have to get up early and my parents are just gonna chill at my house or at our house until they have to go. Some. Lucy's and loving Bucky. French toast. Can I have some French toast, please? No, Bucky, no French toast for you. Do you have two frying pans? Yeah. Yeah. That one's non stick, that. though. It'll work so good. Good morning, you guys. It's Monday What's morning. The here? Uh, one is using the, both the rings now. We did not film at all yesterday. It was kind of like a recovery day from the wedding. We all just sat around and slept pretty much, hung out. I was making French toast, so we scraping the pan with butter. 
probably can't hear me, but the wedding was so fun. Haley and David are now married. Congratulations to them. We all had a blast, and it was like the most beautiful wedding I've ever seen. So, I don't know how much footage I got of the wedding, but whatever I did get, I will, you guys have already seen it. So yeah, now we're making pancakes. Pancakes? We're not making pancakes. No, not in this kitchen. Now we're making French toast. Dad's making his French toast because he's been wanting it. Loves a good French toast. Yesterday we could not film because we were a little bit hungover and just yeah. chilling and laying by the pool and sitting on the couch. Making a coffee now, latte, having a little bit of brunch, oh. and then I'm not sure what we'll do the rest of the day, but we'll bring you guys along because we didn't see anything yesterday. What's your secret to French <clears throat> toast? A good mixture of egg and half and half. Mm. That's the secret recipe for me. And we got raspberries, blueberries. Okay. Maple syrup from Whole Foods. Yeah. <laughs> Whole Foods, throw some love back. Yeah, Whole Foods sponsor us. They're kind of cute, but they're also kind of like cheesy. Well, they're outdoor. Yeah. Llama. Home Depot getting a umbrella stand. We got two new umbrellas yesterday. And we need a stand for them. One of them goes in the pool, so we just need one stand. Oh, look at that. And some pillows maybe for the lounge chairs, but be happy. <laughs> that one's cute. It's only one. Hold it. I'll see if I can find another one. Maybe a chair or a, not a chair, a table. They look like it. There's also these pillows, mom. Oh, look. Like you could put your head on that. Yeah. This one might be too big. Then let's just get these ones. Yeah, this one's really cute. You're getting pillows? Mm -hmm. Well, the lounge, these will match the lounge chair. Okay. The llamas. <laughs> well, is there only one of that one? Unless it's over there. Over here. You like the llamas? The llamas cute because it's gray. Are they la are they gray? Yeah. Oh, the yeah, chairs? Yeah. Andy. Oh, he's got that. Here, you carry one. You All get right. two? Yeah. Do two you want llamas. The long, thin one or the big puppy one? That's fine. Uh, I know. Well we think of the dark one, right? So that the white one doesn't get dirty. Nine. That's it's big. Long. That one's bigger. Huh? Grapefruit. Do you need money? The best way you're not have to pay for lunch is to forget your wallet in the truck. <laughs> Cheapo. Andy, Andy's got it. Goes, Dad got fish and chips. Fish and chips. Fish and chips. She's not getting anything. She already ate. Mother. Andy's getting the fish sandwich probably. I'm what you call a. I'm what you call a cheap date. That's why I forget my wallet because I never have to pay for anything with her. She eats everything at home. Hi, honey. Who's tired? Do you want a coffee? This is literally so good. If you guys live in Arizona, you need to come to Ingo's and get the Ingo's Greyhound. It's literally just grapefruit juice, lemon, and gin. I mean, Andy love it. Usually we get it um, frozen, but one of the best drinks I've ever made, and that's very few. Yeah. Mashed up grapefruit. Yeah. A little bit of juice with it. Um, ginger ale. And yeah. Tito's. Yeah. The it's grapefruit's right. really yummy with. I thought you were gonna have any. I am. How about Amy got it? You brought my Tito's? Rating one out of ten. 
8.5. 8.5? Yeah, these things are fire. This is like a this is like a sour cream dip. It's like sour cream and like pepper maybe. Yeah. A lot later in the day, we're golfing. We got my parents out to golf, which is funny because they've never golfed before, so this should be fun. Me and Andy, me and Andy bought them golf clubs for Christmas last year, and we've gone to the driving range and stuff, but they've never actually really golfed. So this will be funny. I'm wearing this golf shirt, I think it's from Amazon, and then this. Are you serious? Yeah, the shirt is, and then the skirt is aloe. Totally comfy. My hat is Adidas, obviously. My visor. My hat's 112. Yeah. Her hat's 112 from when we first ever started, like four years, three years ago. Wow. That was a beauty. Shit. Perfect. Yeah. Just up the left side. You're so good. You're better than me. Still rolling. Holy crap. Ow. Wow, look at that teacher. Golfing. We didn't take any clips, I don't think, but we also didn't track the score, so. Yeah, we had some clips. We played nine holes. It's 6.30 now, but we're gonna go home and grill some food. I think Andy's parents are gonna come over just to say bye to mine because they leave tomorrow morning, sadly. <gasps> What's he cooking? Way too hot. What? Way too hot. From Whole Foods? Flank steak, yeah. Flank steak? Does the corn need to be wrapped or can it just go on there? Should be wrapped probably. Don't be sad that it's over. Be happy that it happened. Exactly. It's Tuesday morning, the last day of this vlog. We just dropped my parents off. Not just actually, we dropped them off at 4:45 this morning yeah. at the airport. They were on their way back to Montana. They're almost back. Um, sad. We had such a good weekend with them. Golfing yesterday was so fun. My dad actually crushed it. Actually, both my parents crushed it. Yeah. They were like, they've never golfed like in a real, like they've never gone to an actual golf course and golf. We golfed nine holes. I don't even know what I'm saying. And I'm losing my voice. <clears throat> right? Is that accurate? Yeah. They've never played on the actual golf course. There you go. That's what I was trying to they've say. They've only went to the driving range. Yeah, and they did really well. My dad, the first tee, he l crushed the ball. Yeah. Like, what? Okay. But then Andy's parents came over for dinner afterwards, and we all hung out and just reminisced on the weekend. And now everyone's back to their normal lives. Haley and David are a married couple. We're at Starbucks. What's new? Heading to work. Starblinks. Got an iced oat milk latte and a ham and cheese croissant. And you got a sandwich. Hey. Thank you. Could I do a straw, please? That's funny. Whatever. Language is hard today. Yeah. We'll probably end off the vlog some point today, but I wanted to ask you guys, or we wanted to ask you guys, if you have any questions for us, we're gonna do a Q&A sometime <laughs> soon, probably in the next video. So if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments and we'll answer them in a Q&A soon. Wow. Ooh. Probably in our next next week's video, but the next week or two is also going to be really crazy busy. Honestly, the next month is going to be busy because we have to go to Rachel's wedding. Yeah. Not this weekend, but next weekend. And then I have a bachelorette, my friend, the, I'm throwing my friend's bachelorette party the weekend after that. And then my birthday is coming up too. Got something special planned? Yeah. <laughs> You have to wait and find out. We might go to Montana. We might have my parents come back. I'm not sure. But we also have to drop our shoes in the meantime with all of this happening. So it's an exciting time. Now let's have some coffee and get to work. Mm -hmm.